Greetings and welcome back to this tutorial. Let's explore some of the applications of blockchain in this video. As we have discussed, the applications of blockchain extend much more beyond the cryptocurrency networks and it can be applicable to the sectors like banking and financial sector, real estate, supply chain and logistics sector, elections and surveys, so on and so forth. Let's dig down into two of the applications and see how blockchain can be helpful for such kind of application. First, we will explore the asset management application. Now, let's just consider a product which is being sold cross country. So it can be a car or it can be a medicine which is sold cross country. Now, before the product lands into the hands of the customer, it goes through various different entities. That is, it can start from the manufacturer to the wholesaler, exporter, importer, retailer, and then finally it lands in the hands of the customer. And each of these entities may also have different warehouses and the transit information for their freights. Now each of these parties might be also maintaining the separate copies of their ledger and separate transactions. Now just think about a scenario. If this entire thing is brought into a single instance of blockchain and if that happens it can help to create a distributed ledger which is transparent to all the parties which cannot be tempered and since it cannot be tempered it creates a trust value amongst all the parties and the entities and it can also help resolve any disputes the main point is that for a given product you can trace down an entire history of the transaction an entire history about where the product has been gone through in its entire life cycle can be traced down. If it is a car, we can trace down that particular spare part of a car was bought from which particular supplier and is now in the hands of which customers, so on and so forth from a single platform. So such kind of applications can be very effectively made up by using the blockchain framework. Let's explore one more application that is property management. Now a given property can be an office, home, a land, so on and so forth. And that property can be owned by multiple owners. So generally the government should have a track record or a history of the ownership of a given property. If we have the ownership history of a given property, we can actually understand who is the current owner of that particular property. So whenever a sale or a buying of that property takes place, you should have a transaction entry for the transfer of the ownership of the property. If the government does not have the proper record of that transfer of ownership, there can be a dispute for the property and then issues may arise. So think about it. If the entire ownership history of the property is taken on the blockchain platform, then it can help to create a single distributed ledger transparent to all and cannot be tempered by any party. And hence, this can also help in resolving all the disputes and it will help government to take care of the taxes and so on and so forth. So in this way, blockchain can be also applicable to the applications of property management. So these are few of the applications which we have discussed. Just think about it that so many opportunities are still upon for the application of blockchain in different areas. In the next video, we will see the different frameworks which are there based on the concept of blockchain. Thank you.